And the Federal Ministry of Health has vowed to reduce malaria prevalence in the country through collaborative efforts with the media. This came to bear today in Abuja at a media sensitization program organized for media practitioners. Pastor Emmanuel Hijana completes the story. Malaria is a public issue that affects every Nigerian. This statement is supported by a 2022 report which suggests Nigeria has the highest prevalence of malaria in the world. The report also stated that children under the age of five years, including pregnant women, are more susceptible, which suggests that emphasis should be placed on how to prevent its prevalence in the country. 2015, it was 27%. Um, 2021, it was 22%. And I, I can assure you that if we done it in 2024, it will be less. We have deployed new strategies. First, we provide uh, anti-malaria medicines. We also distribute nets. And most recently, we have started seasonal malaria chemopreventive treatment, especially in the northern part of the country where malaria is very prevalent. Rafael Oyilo, who is the head of the branch for the program, also affirmed why the media must continue to engage the ministry on ways to create awareness and ways to tackle malaria attacks. The right information is a matter that you will use to inform our public on malaria prevention, diagnosis, and treatment. As well, this also so that we give the right information to our bodies. We are relying on you. Because for any information, it is needed that the media must play a vital role. In their goodwill messages, Stakeholders called on the media to go steps further to report and investigate the lifestyle of people and also sensitize Nigerians on how to deal with malaria in various localities. People tend to want to read the second one more than the first one. The one that is just fact and they're like, mm. but the ones that capture malaria and how it's making a negative or a positive impact in the lives of people in the community, that is what I want to push you to also do. Go to the communities, find out. Today we're focusing on care seeking. Do people really go to the facilities? Where do they go? Why do they go there? What can we do? The, the factors that are underplaying the seeking of care by people in the communities. How do we make a difference as media personnel? There's no doubt about the fact that our people must know how to fight malaria. And there is no any other organization that is like that, other than malaria. We are very close to the people. They are looking towards us for information. And they want to hear the valid and reliable information from them. And that is why it is key for NMEP to network and synchronize our activity with the media organization so that then we hear the real information, then we act on the information. If malaria is going to be eliminated, it's going to come from them. A presentation on improving care seeking behavior for Nigeria control and the answer is that prompt treatment of malaria is the only way to treat malaria attacks. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.